Hello guys and welcome back to Persona 3 Reload. In the last episode, if you don't remember, we went as far as we could in Tartarus. We got to the border floor on floor 22, and we've just got to kind of wait to see if that'll open up or not. So in this episode, first of all, I'm going to register Pixie into the compendium. Second of all, we're finally going to leave. We've spent like the past two episodes in here, and I think I've spent a total of two hours in here because obviously I edited the Tartarus episodes down much shorter than what they were before editing. So yeah, let's head back. Yes. What's the matter? Are you done for the day? Let's call it quits. Alright, rest up and come prepared for our next expedition. Oh, trust me, we will. There will hopefully be some better equipment in the uh, shop and... There's some other stuff that'll help us on our next expedition. Yo. Yo, Yuki, you by yourself today? Dude, was the rumor about you and Takabasan coming to school together even true? Only on the first day. You sure? Oh yeah? Well, it's not like I care or anything. Anyways, you must be pretty unlucky to have to transfer here. Wait, you seriously don't know? Weird stuff's been happening at this school. There are a couple of folks who say they've heard strange voices. But I guess since you've always... But I guess since you're always wearing those headphones, you probably haven't heard anything. So it's a common joke slash fan theory that all of the music we hear in the game is coming from... Oh, Yo, what's up? Hey man, I'm gonna get some ramen after school. You wanna come? I'll talk to you in just a second, Tomachika. But it's a common joke slash fan theory that all of the music we hear in the game is just stuff that uh, Yuki is listening to on his headphones. But that doesn't really make sense because since his uh, MP3 player stops working during the dark hour, so you wouldn't hear anything during the dark hour. Uh, but it's still like a funny sort of joke, I guess. Anyways, Tomachika's asking us out for ramen. Uh, why are you asking me? No reason, really. Just don't have anything to do later. Plus, I figured we could finish our chat from this morning. So how about it, man? Let's get some ramen at the mall and talk. I'm going to hang out with my classmate after school. According to Igor, the strength of a social length is the strength of a persona. I decided to go with him. <laughs> now that's what I'm talking about. Well, was I right or was I right? The soup here tastes great, doesn't it? We've got to put some special ingredient in it. Something no other ramen shop would ever use. Maybe there's a secret clue in the shop's name. Ah, my bad. I always geek out a little whenever I eat here. So, what we are currently in right now is our first social link. I mean, technically, C's was our first social link, but this is our first real social link that we can hang out with. So, this is where dialogue options start to matter. During your first social link event dialogue options don't really matter that all that much but as we continue to rank up our social links what we say will absolutely have an impact on stuff but like i said before though you can say whatever here i'll just say i know what you mean you do really you taste the magic too man i wasn't expecting that i think i'm liking you more by the minute by the way I hear you and Takeba-san are pretty close. Damn, and you just transferred here too. Well, I can't blame you. Man's gotta be aggressive in this day and age. Hey, let's hang out after school again sometime. Let me know when you're free. I'll tell you all about my secret plan. Dude, you're gonna flip when you hear it. Kenji Tomachika seems to have taken a liking to me. Uh, a voice is ringing inside my head. And thou, thou art I, thou hast established a new bond. Thou shalt have our blessing when thou choosest to create a persona of the magician arcana. So 
Social links. When you meet certain people in the school or in the city, you may develop a social link with them. When fusing personas, these social links will affect the results of the fusion. When you fuse a persona that has the same arcana as one of your social links, the resulting persona will gain bonus experience. Try to establish relationships with many people to enhance your persona's capabilities. So not only do social links help out with uh, characterization, they help out with personas as well, making them higher level when you fuse them. And there's also an extra thing that uh, helps us out that they don't mention here. What, it's already dark? Damn, I missed my favorite show. Man, for real? Oh well. well let's get going. Uh, but first, let's swap numbers. Bust out that cell phone. Receiving invites by text. You can now receive invites via messages from your social links. After you've visited a business at least once, you'll be added to their mailing list. Visit different facilities to receive updates and special offers. No, you cannot unsubscribe from the mailing lists. So you'll see ads if you go to new restaurants and stuff like that. So this is sort of an upgraded thing from Persona 5, where to make uh, talking to social links easier, it gave you a thing where some of the social links that wanted to hang out with you would send you a message saying, hey, want to go hang out. Uh, this makes stuff very convenient, and uh, I'm grateful that this was added, and also they send some really funny messages sometimes, so I can't wait for you guys to see those. I decided to return to the dorm. Oh, it's you. Welcome back. Welcome back. By the way, regarding the Dark Hour, this may go without saying, but it is impossible to do business at any stores during this that time, so make sure that you're ready in advance. You don't want to be caught unprepared when it's too late. So I just realized, uh, since we were hanging out with Tomachika the whole time, we weren't able to do something else that I wanted to do at the school. I'll just state it right now. If you go to the nurse's office after you complete a run of Tartarus, then you'll be able to up your courage stat um, a little bit. But only, I think, the day after that. In the original Persona 3, it was whenever you'd get tired, but since there's no tired thing, it's just whenever you leave Tartarus. Anyways, now we're kind of out of the whole tutorial thing. I don't think there are going to be any tutorials after this. There might be one or two, but we're mostly free to do whatever we want now, such as going outside. Currently, we could go to two places right now, Iwatodai Station Strip Mall and Polonia Mall. We, of course, also have the student dormitory, but there's not too much going on there, and we've already talked to everyone as much as we can. Uh, I think in the original Persona 3 and all of its various versions, you could only go to Polonia Mall at night, but Iwatodai Strip Mall was added so you can go places there too. Let's just check out Polonia Mall for now. So I don't think the police station is open at the moment. Oh no, it is! Forget me. Uh, don't worry, I won't ask you what you want any of this for. I just do what I think is right. So currently we have 17,600 yen, which is a pretty good amount. But that is all before we have sold stuff from Tartarus. If you go to sell item, and you look at valuables, this is all stuff that doesn't have any use other than to sell. So if we sell all of this, we'll get an additional 16,000 yen. I'll take so 34,000 yen is not too shabby at the beginning of the game. Uh, I'm going to keep shopping. What do you got? Also going to sell some of the weapons that we don't need because we're not going to sure use them ever again. <laughs> Accessories. I might use those later. If I really am strapped for money, I might sell some of these. And there aren't really any consumables, at least to my knowledge, that I want to sell. Hmm? You so let's just leave Come for now. Soon. There's a lot of stuff that we can do to help raise our social stats. Uh, the first one that I want to point out is one that I used a lot during my playthroughs of the original Persona 3, The Game Parade. Various arcade games are inside. So this will have various, as I mentioned in a previous video I'm pretty sure, it costs $3,000 but it'll help raise our st social stats by a lot. You're the answer, like it says, raises academics. And I'm pretty sure your the answer is here every Wednesday and Saturday. Uh, I'm not sure what the CD and DVD places for. Let me save here real quick and see what it does. Okay, it's just it sells a variety of music. There's nothing else here. This is just for shopping. Uh, Mandragora helps raise your courage. This is just a weapon shop. 
uh, Chagall Cafe helps raise uh, charm, and you can also work here on Mondays, Tuesdays, and Wednesdays to earn more money. And you also get from that charm and courage, but it only raises up a tiny bit. For now, I'll go ahead and uh, I want to show off each of these things, so for now I'll do Game Parade and raise up academics a little bit. I do want to raise up academics quite a lot because... Also, I love how this is just called Very Interesting Game, the arcade game that we're playing. Played you at the answer, my mind feels sharper after beating other plays with my quick answers. But yeah, I want to show off all the ways you can level up your stats. So that gave us two music notes. I'm pretty sure there's something wonky with how they present the way that you get social stats and how it actually is. I'll mention that in edit editing if there's something to that. I can hear people talking. You know what? Is it just me, or have there been more weird people around lately? Wow. L like the ones with apathy syndrome? There's some in my neighborhood too. It's seriously creepy. Sometimes I wonder what what'll happen if I end up like that, and it just depresses me. Mm. Maybe it will be okay if we exercise and improve our stamina. Actually, I heard that the track team is still accepting new members. Maybe running will make us stronger. Seems like the track team is recruiting new members. Maybe I can learn more about it if I visit their club room. The first bell has rung. Class has ended for today. Apparently the track team is recruiting new members. If I find where they practice, maybe I could see about possibly joining the team. So, funny thing about this. We could go ahead and hang out with Tomachika a bit more. And he just sent us a message. You free today? Finally, class is over. You want to hang out after school? I'm just going to stick around for a bit, so swing by my desk if you're down. But there's also something else we can do, and it's related to that track team. First of all, let me talk to these guys. Looks like so the athletic members are recruiting new members. Actually, it's just the track and field team. I guess the others are full. That's actually something I do want to get into, the other uh, teams. If you're interested in joining, why don't you go check it out? From the classroom, go down the stairs to the right, and eventually you'll find it. Okay, weird question, but how do you think it's really possible to kick ass in Tartarus and in school? Uh, piece of cake. Yeah! Well, aren't you confident? Why don't you put your money where your mouth is? Oh, we will. Trust me. Since you're being transferred here, do you find yourself getting lost inside of school? Not really. And it just ends the conversation. Okay. Yuki-kun, when you were absent, there was an election for student council president. Kirijo senpais speech was so cool, I voted for her. Everyone else... Looks so small compared to Kurijo Senpai. Ah, <sighs> Kurijo Senpai. School's barely started and there's already been a student who dropped out. She only had two years left. What'll she do if she doesn't even graduate from high school? Kind of a waste, don't you think? You only get to be a high schooler once in your life. But it's her life, not mine. Not like it really matters to me. My parents always nag me, like, study for exams and stuff. They're so annoying. I just became a second year. I'm supposed to be having fun. They just came, they just came into some money, so they're getting all strict about my future and junk. What do you want? I'm using my cell now. Talk to me when I'm not busy. So this is an area that we went to when we were looking for Twilight Fragments, but I didn't really explain all that much. Uh, there's a hallway leading out here that leads to this uh, little persimmon tree. And there's actually this person. That tree seems special for some reason. I wonder why it's there. Does it commemorate something? We'll keep that question in mind for later. At the end of this corridor, there's a, the gym hallway. And right over here, this little indicator shows that there's a social link that we can go to. It's right at the end of the hallway. But there's also these two doors over here. Indoor swimming pool. The swim team seems to be using the pool. There's a note that says sorry, but the swim team is no longer recruiting new members. It's the door to the gym. The kendo team seems to be using it. There's a note that says sorry, but the kendo team is no longer recruiting new members. Kendo is like, to my knowledge, some type of sword fighting. The thing is, you're only able to go to the track team, but in the original versions of Persona 3, this was not the case. You were able to join the kendo team and the swim team if you wanted, and you got to choose. It doesn't change the social link at all, but you could, and I'm pretty sure in the Persona 3 movies, uh, Yuki joins the kendo team, and I totally would have done that too, because sword fighting is super cool. But anyways, let's join the track team. Note that says, track team now recruiting, no slow po pokes, please. We could join the club, or we could just take a quick tour for a second. The track team is training hard. 
And that's it. Okay. Let's actually join it now. Hmm? Aren't you from Miss Toriyumi's class? Oh, you want to join the team? I'll take care of all the paperwork, so go ahead and introduce yourself to your new teammates. Alright, everyone, gather around. So, starting today, he's an official member of the team. I'm Makoto Yuki. Welcome aboard. I'm Yuko Nishiwaki. She's our team manager. She'll answer any of your questions. You're a second year, right? Since we're in the same grade, you can just call me Yuko. Let's see. Hey, Miyamoto. Yes. This here's our future team captain. A great runner and places well in competitions. You two are in the same class, right? Miyamoto, keep an eye on the new guy here, okay? You got it. You're the guy who went out with Takeba on the first day of school, right? You're practically a celebrity. I'm Kazushi Miyamoto. You've seen me around, right? Yeah. Then, long story short, from now on, you're mine after school. You better not think you're getting the easy treatment just because you joined mid-season. Miyamoto's given me a warm welcome. I joined the track team and made friends with my new teammates. So we get yet another social link right off the bat. There will be quite a few in these first uh, couple of months. Most of the social links are in like April, May, June-ish like time frame. And then there are a couple that you can get to or, or later in the game. Since this is your first practice, just have a look around and then call it a day. We have practice on Mondays, Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays. There's no practice the days before tests, though. I'll make sure your uniform is ready for next time. After looking around, I decided to go back to the dorm. It's Yuko, the team manager. Should I say hello? Be sure to say hello here. Now, here you want to ask, want to walk home together? Actually, no, I'm in a hurry today. See ya. Yuko went home alone. I decided to go back to the dorm myself. Ah, darn it. Welcome back. Sup, dude? Oh yeah, so your buddy's with Tomachika now? He was saying you're someone to watch out for. Oh, but in a good way. Hell yeah, I am. <laughs> <laughs> I can see why you two get along. He's kind of a ladies' man, but he's a good dude. Oh, I almost forgot. I was going to ask if you want to go to Tartarus tonight. Looks like there's a lot more of those lost, so we got to take out more shadows, right? Prepare for people to ask, like, every day. Like, hey, do you want to go to Tartarus? Hey, do you want to go to Tartarus? Just constantly. Yo. The doctor told me to rest, but I don't want to risk my... Ri but I don't want to risk losing my edge. I was thinking that getting back into training could be a good way to rehabilitate, but if Mitsuru finds out, being told to, to rest will be the least of my worries. Hey, so... Kurijo senpai is so stoic, isn't she? Well, she has a lot of responsibilities, so maybe it kind of comes with the territory. Mm? Bro, don't weapons and armor cost way too much? I mean, I guess quality matters. It does kind of make me feel stronger. I know we can't be stingy when it comes to equipment, but man, my wallet is crying in pain. Hmm? hmm? Is something the matter? Just wanted to chat. Let's see. Tartarus, riddled with mysteries as it is, will no doubt challenge you with unexpected encounters. If you ever feel outmatched, there's no shame in a wise retreat. Good words to keep in mind. Let's head back to Polonia for a second. If we head to Game Parade, now we've changed out the stuff here. Our, the one that we're going for is High School of Youth, which raises charm. Play the dating simulator High School of Youth. I practice some lines and mannerisms that I can use to make a good impression with girls. I can hear people talking. My parents have been nagging me to stop staying out late at night recently. 
They said they don't want me to end up like those people who suddenly go crazy. Oh, you mean apathy syndrome? But I heard they still don't know what causes it, so what's the point of being careful? I know, right? Yeah, I know, right? The prime the time to hit it up hit up the arcade or work a shift is late at night too. And I can't go to Hagakure at night anymore, so then I'll miss out on the taste of happiness. Seems like some stores are open at night too. I should go check them out when I have the time. The first bell is rung. So right now at the moment, as you can see in class, we have two people we can hang out with. Um, and we have text from both of them too, as well as an ad from Hagakure Ramen. So we'll decide who we want to hang out with in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye!